Crow here. And before you ask, I am in a slightly different environment as I am to normal. Because currently I'm up in the north in um in Newcastle because I have my dad has a side of the family down here and we're currently down um and we're up even. We're currently up here visiting them. But we just went downtown today, had a bit of a walk around. I bought my uh being me, I bought my PSP with me. And I got, today, I got two new games for it. I got Tomb Raider Legend, and I got them both from game. Uh, it, was, it was a bit of a, it was a deal. I paid £25 for a Grand Theft Auto Vice City Stories, <coughs> excuse me, which was the other game I got. <coughs> and I got two, <coughs> and I got Tomb Raider Legend 3. You'll have to excuse the coughing. My throat suddenly got a bit clogged up. I'm going to be doing each of these in one video though no I mean I'm gonna be giving each of these a video each so it so it just out just so I don't go over the file size limit or the 10 minute time limit or whatever and so let's just get to opening this I've now noticed that there's little tags on the bottom of the games to make opening them a bit easier if you could just get at the tag that is um, excuse me a second uh, I'm gonna have to put the camera down I'm not used to this environment as you as I don't know where a knife is in here so I'm not uh, adap adaptation never was one of my strong points ah uh, here we go well that proved considerably easier than usual probably because I hacked at the tag first there's the back, you've probably seen it like a million times in the other versions. And I'm not going to read through the manual, I'm just going to take a quick peek. I've learned that, that you can't actually do that. There's the, um, a little advert for Tomb Raider Anniversary, which I also plan to buy for the PSP. And I know people are saying the PSP version is terrible, it controls really bad, but I've played it, and I don't think it controls that badly for the stick. And I hate these UMDs, they don't want to come out. I had the same problem with Ratchet and Clank size matters. Anyway, here, and I'm just going to show me starting this up for the first time. As you may have noticed, I'm rushing a lot less now as well, because I, I'm i using my new 4GB memory stick, but I'm using, um, I'm using a Pro Duo adapter that turns it into a regular memory stick, which is pretty nice, convenient. Takes case gaming set. This has got to start up. I think I should turn the brightness down a bit. Is that easier to see? Sorry this is taking so long people, the original PSP does take a while to load UMD games. <sighs> yeah, Lara Croft, new Tomb Raider, look, so copyrighted, we all know the copyright rules by now. Memory stick, not fat, oh. I'm sorry to cut this short. It says there's no memory stick in there. I'm going to have to figure out what's wrong with the PSP. Oh, the same thing happened with actually opening the PSP. I'm really sorry about this, guys. Now there's a huge pointless chunk on the video. But anyway, I'll see you all in a bit, alright?